everybody. Pat Flannery here. I'm the editor of Canadian Contractor Magazine. And uh, today we have uh, uh, really one of my favorite topics. We're going to be talking windows with uh, a couple of uh, experts from Geldwin. Uh, we've got with us here today, uh, Paul Camiso. He is the Director of Marketing and Product Line Management for Geldwin Canada. How are you doing, Paul? I'm doing great, Patrick. Thank you. And we, we also have Jeff Pigeon. He is the Product Line Manager and I'm assured the real expert uh, in all of this. <laughs> also, sure. also from Geldwin, Canada. Hi, hi, Jeff. How you doing? Hey, good, Patrick. Thanks. Yeah, great to see. Great to see both of you guys. So we're going to talk some windows and doors, uh, mostly windows, actually. Um, I always say windows and doors because uh, that, that they're together in my mind. Um, and uh, what we uh, what what I think uh, the first thing we want to talk about is really, we're going to be getting into some of, uh, of Geldwin's innovation, some of the technology you guys have been working on. But I guess, I guess first, Jeff, from a, from a top level perspective, um, you know, we see that energy efficiency is really driving innovation in, in, in this sector, really more than I, I think any other, any other factor and a little bit of comfort, a little bit of operability, but really it's, it's the energy thing is, is, is what's driving the industry these days. Um, uh, tell me, tell me a bit about, about Geldwin's focus on that and, and, and why energy efficiency is, is such a priority for Geldwin. Yeah, sure. Yeah. So the windows and doors can be a significant source of energy loss in your home, typically up to 35%. So, uh, in Canada's climate, that means higher energy bills for homeowners. So, but choosing highly efficient windows and doors can help and, and replacing all of your windows uh, with Geldwin Energy Star certified models can save you up an average of 45% on your energy bill. So that's kind of where the importance comes from. Um, you know, the, you know, Energy Star certified doors uh, are 25% more efficient than a regular standard door. So that improvement is, is sort of been our focus. And, and really we're one of the only full line manufacturers of windows and doors with value and performance for every price point in the marketplace. So that's been our, our focus um, over the last couple of years, just with the Energy Star uh, changes that were coming um, and making sure that we had uh, available options for homeowners. Yeah, becoming more important all the time, becoming more sought after uh, for sure, uh, becoming more demanded by regulations and by the building codes. Yeah. Uh, that, that, that sort of, that sort of thing is, uh, is, uh, you know, it's, it's just obviously the, the, the biggest, the biggest priority in, in terms of everything. So, Paul, you guys have, uh, have, have sort of, you've got something new going on to try to meet these challenges. Um, it's, uh, if I have the name right, the Northern tri Pain Collection. Um, why don't you tell us a bit about, uh, a bit about the thinking there and, uh, and what's gone into this new uh, product line? Sure, yeah, absolutely. So uh, as Jeff mentioned, the Energy Star program uh, for Canada was changing from 2020. Prior to 2020, there was three Energy Star climate zones and most of the windows in the country that were being sold were compliant with zone two. So as of January, 2020, uh, this kind of reduced down to one zone for all of Canada. And it made the energy efficiency guidelines much more strict, uh, something that manufacturers of windows and doors need to respond to. So the technology that Geldwin has developed for our tri window offerings across three separate uh, regionally specific window lines that we offer in Canada uh, when you when you added the tri pane window or the tri pane glass to our offering, <clears throat> really, we met and exceeded in most cases the 2020 Energy Star guidelines. So we felt that this was important. Uh, we wanted to tell everybody about it. Uh, this is really the key differentiator for for Geldwin. So we set out to package this message in a way that was unique, really speaks to the benefits of a Geldwin tri pane window, um, and the name Northern Tri Pane Collection was born from that. So the Northern tri Pain Collection really is just about uh, marketing and selling a high efficiency uh, sound insulating window that's best in class. Uh, our campaign for this product was intended to educate the homeowner as well as provide some unique sales aids uh, to the consulting trade professional, right? So they can use that with the homeowner to explain the benefits of a tri Pain window and what they're gonna get from it. Uh, so to raise awareness, we built new marketing materials, uh, some unique tools, including a test kit, which a homeowner can use to test the energy efficiency of their existing windows in the cold winter months. Uh, really get a sense of, are my windows energy efficient right now? And what should I be thinking of uh, when, when I'm planning to replace these windows? 
Um, or if you're building a new home, should I be looking at a tri-pane window versus a dual pane? What's the benefit? Uh, we also built a website which hosts an energy savings calculator. And this is really where the rubber hits the road. We worked with Enercan data to model energy savings in every major city across the country um, and, and made that data available to, to the consumer and to the trade professional. So with the calculator, a homeowner can really visualize the year over year return on investment they're gonna get from choosing gelled and tri-pane windows. And then once someone understands the benefit of a tri-pane uh, and what it provides over, over time, it really becomes a much easier decision. Uh, so they can, you know, anybody can visit the website. It's available now. The calculator's there as well. It's uh, www.keepoutsideout.com. You know, th th and this, this this is a key message that, that I, I want my contractors to, to really focus on. We're all used to doubles. Um, uh, uh, double pane insulating glass has obviously been around forever. Um, and, uh, and, but, but what is coming is, is the need for triple pane gla uh, insulating glass is, is absolutely going to be coming forward in the market. Um, and, and so everybody has got to get used to, uh, uh, you're going to have, you're going to have these triple units and, uh, and, and there's going to be, uh, possibly some differences, um, with them and, 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 but just. You, you need to be able to communicate to your clients um, um, what is going to change here. And, and, and there are so many, uh, it, frankly, it's a better window. I mean, there, 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 there's, there, there's no really doubt about that. Um, and, and like you say, comfort, sound, along with the energy efficiency, there's, there's definitely advantages. Jeff, why don't you hit on some of the advantages for us yeah. uh, uh, for a, the, the, tri the tri-pane window? Yeah, so a couple of things for, for homeowners sort of uh, looking into and inquiring about tripane options. So with, with our tripane glass, we, we use a half inch airspace. And really what we're doing there is maximizing the efficiency and the performance of that glass, right? So uh, tests have been done to, to really hit that top number and, and half inch airspace gets us there. Um, it's a highly versatile offering from our, our northern tripane collection. We offer tilt in and lift out options, plus a hybrid, which is an aluminum clad exterior option. Um, better thermal and structural performance. Some of the numbers, uh, when people are looking into it, the numbers and the, and the data will be there for the tripane uh, performance and, and structural performance. Um, it's compliant with Energy Star 2020 requirements. So that's a bit of a guideline for homeowners to take a look at. And it's available nationwide, um, as Paul mentioned too, from all three of our facilities in Canada. So what we're seeing in the in the standards right now uh, in in Canada, Jeff, is 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 definitely tightening, uh, moving towards ever. Uh, uh, so, well, the, the the goal is to have net zero houses by 2030, or I think they might have updated that to 2032. Yeah, 2030, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The, 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 this is this is what we're trying to get to: is houses that literally don't effectively use any energy or, 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 or produce, or I don't know how they calculate it, but it, but somehow yeah. they produce as much as they, somehow they produce as much as they get um, or, or net zero ready is the term, because of course, if you don't have solar panels, you're not producing any energy. So uh, uh, physically you can't be net zero, but, uh, but the idea is to have net zero ready houses, which is very, very high levels of insulation. So, so Jeff, mm. put, put, put the tri paint, put the Northern tri paint into that picture um, um, how are you looking? How are how are you looking at things uh, uh, as the standards continue to tighten, and, and how is this product going to going to help the homeowner, uh, and 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 I guess builders who who are supplying products stay within in, in those requirements. Yeah, so a, a couple of things there, Patrick. Just to, with regards to the twenty thirty, obviously we're we're spending time and and taking a look at new technologies to kind of get us to some of those targets, mm -hmm. and that'll be an ongoing process that we, we work. Uh, part of my team and, and how we in, uh, look into some of those new technologies that will come available. Mm -hmm. uh, but currently our, our, our tripane offerings are, are basically future ready and will meet the energy efficient re requirements for Energy Star program and, and the Canadian building codes for, for years to come. So um, we're a little bit ahead of the curve and, and we've got uh, our team in place that will kind of take a look at those new technologies and, and see if we can bring them to the market and, and the the end goal is always energy efficiency. Yeah, it's it's. Uh, I think I think by 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 just going ahead and doing a triple, you guys have you guys have have uh, you know, 
definitely position yourselves ahead of the curve because because that's 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 what it's going to have to get to at least with present yeah. technology unless unless somebody invents the most fantastic low e coding ever known to mankind you know it's it's <laughs> that, you know that that's basically that's basically where we're at so yeah. i mean I, I and 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 that's that's good uh uh you know they've they've done triples and well manitoba loves triples they did them for years yeah. <laughs> you know i mean it's 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 uh it's it's not uh, it's not too far out of the box so um let's talk a little bit about um about some of the other some of the other things what are, what are some of the style and 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 design options that that, that people are going to see in these in these uh, tripane collections yeah. yeah, so it, it's good to note. So basically, our, our northern tripane collection is, is really a way of marketing our tripane offering uh, to homeowners. So sort of that one stop where they can get educated and find the, the information they're looking for uh, on the benefits of tripane. Um, so basically, as we grow in a, a, our regional offerings and, and we add options to our regional offerings, uh, so, you know, new colors, new features, um, our tripane options will evolve with those regional offerings. So there never has to be sort of that trade off of options versus performance. Basically, the homeowner can really have the best of both worlds in that case. Hmm. Sounds terrific. And uh, and and f so so mo more is planned for the future. You're 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 looking at, at 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 updating things. Obviously, there'll be more rolling out as you go down the road. Yep. So as we look to sort of new features and benefits on our regular lines, we want to make sure that we include them in our northern tripane. So if it's new colors or new uh, exterior options or interior options, uh, part of our goal was make sure they're going to be available uh, on the tripane option as well. Great. Fantastic. Um, I always I always love uh, uh, having you guys on because uh, this is when I can pick your brain on trends. Um, what are you guys seeing that's that's popular right now, uh, Jeff? What are what 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 is what is what is selling well, and 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 how does the tripane collection fit into that uh, those expectations? Yeah, so some of the trends we've seen over the last couple of years are are sort of those the, the dark colors, exterior colors uh, being really trendy and, and sort of heavily weighted on the the darker colors. Uh, so we're looking at some options, uh, obviously painting uh, exterior. Uh, laminating uh, with a vinyl oh. laminate exterior, which is a little bit more durable, a little bit better performing in the dark colors for heat buildup, things like that. And then the other trend that we're really seeing is, is sort of um, a move to larger glass openings, so larger windows in general, uh, a little bit slimmer profiles uh, of the vinyl, so more glass, uh, more viewing area for the homeowners. And those two are, are kind of what we're focused on in, in trying to reduce the amount of vinyl, maximize our glass, and sort of hit on some of those trends, as well as the color trend. We're, we're painting in our facilities currently. We're, we're um, exploring the option of the laminate exterior, which really brings more durability and better performance from a heat buildup perspective. So those are sort of the two major ones that we've, we've focused on the last little bit. Yeah, laminate's something we got to jump on in Ontario a little more than has been uh, in, the, yeah. in the past. Yeah, <laughs> we, we see sort of hot spots, when, but it, it it's coming, and it, it's uh, it's a pretty um, it's a great option for an exterior color, yeah. yeah. Uh, especially when we start to see those darker colors trending, the blacks and the dark browns and everything too. Yeah, it's 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 remarkable actually what's happened in that in that in that category. Uh, 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 heat build up with dark colors. That's why all vinyl was white for so long. Yeah. Heat build up, heat, heat build up on the seals used to be uh, an impossible problem, and 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 now there's technology. I don't know. I guess it's bouncing infrared or something. That's that's uh, that seems to be that seems to be solving a lot of that. Sorry, I'm I'm going off into window technology wonkery, <laughs> uh, but uh, that's <laughs> I, I, that stuff is interesting to me. What can I say? Yeah. Um, it, Paul, we got to get you back in here. Uh, 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 no conversation can occur. Uh, these days, uh, without uh, COVID stories, so <laughs> we, we we have uh, uh, let, let's let's find out uh, uh, from you what what how, how Geldman has reacted to this whole thing. Um, um, what is going on with you guys? Um, um, what's the response been like? What are you seeing out there? Um, give it give us your give us your your COVID overview. Yeah. Um, well, you know, like 
so many other manufacturers across country, the country, uh, Jelton's had to adapt at lightning speed to kind of continue to deliver uh, products and deliver on our commitments that we've made to our customers. You know, at the same time, we've had to make sure, and most importantly, at the same time, we've got to make sure that our, our employees and our people are safe and healthy. So across all our manufacturing facilities in Canada, we've got, you know, four manufacturing facilities, two distribution centers, uh, and moreover, across the world, uh, Gelbin is a global company, so we operate manufacturing facilities in 20 countries. I think we've done a really great job of streamlining our approach to health and safety measures in, inside of our facilities, inside of our plants. Uh, the measures that we've taken, like, you know, again, like so many other manufacturers, um, you know, constant sanitization efforts in our facilities, health checks, physical distancing um, on our manufacturing floors, uh, and moving the vast majority of our office employees to remote work like Jeff and myself today. Um, you know, I think the, the building materials industry in general um, has hasn't suffered as much as many other industries, uh, mainly because, you know, consumers are, are at home more, uh, spending more time at home, realizing some of those projects they've been putting off for years, they've got a bit more time uh, and maybe a bit more money to, uh, to invest in. Um, and so, and so the, the, the sales have continued, which is great. Uh, but in order to take advantage of an opportunity like that, I think uh, what, uh, what set Jeldwin apart was as a global organization, um, we were able to execute on these health and safety measures to keep us manufacturing and delivering products to our customers who are then selling those to consumers. Uh, so, so COVID as this continues, uh, obviously in the second wave, it's gonna be much more important to focus on our people and make sure that everyone's uh, health, healthy, uh, safe and at work. Yeah, but you guys have got the resources to do that. And, uh, and uh, it sounds like, uh, it sounds like you got on it and, and, and kept things going. And now there's, now there's all those vacation dollars out there that aren't getting spent. So uh, <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's, it's good news if everyone can just keep up. Yeah. That's, the, that's yeah. the big, that's, that's, that's the big challenge for sure. Right. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Um, Paul, give us the, give us the look down the road. Um, uh, you know, Jeldwin, uh, major iconic player in the Canadian market, obviously, everywhere you look. Um, um, what, what, can we, what can we expect uh, from, you guys, uh, from you guys going forward here? What are, what are, what are the plans? Okay, I'll, uh, I'll give you a sneak peek. Um, nice. So, so Jeldwin has a pretty deep uh, portfolio of trusted brands, uh, specifically, you know, in, across the globe, but specifically in Canada. We're well known in Canada, as, as you said. But we also have that global reach, so there's a healthy pipeline of innovation uh, that we can draw from. So all of our devel development work is grounded in current and future trends. Some of them Jeff, Jeff had already mentioned. So, for example, the windows and doors uh, or patio doors becoming larger. Consumers want less obstructed sight lines and they want to let more natural light in. Uh, so as a sustainability-minded manufacturer, we're working to ensure that this is possible while still achieving those superior levels of energy efficiency. That's always going to be a, our number one goal uh, in reacting to any type of uh, consumer trend is, yes, we want to do it, but it can't just be all looks and no performance. It's got to have both. Um, we're working more with new materials, uh, ones that are either laminated over vinyl or new materials like composites. Uh, as Jeff mentioned, we talked a bit about laminate. Uh, Patrick, you suggested that we need more of that in Ontario. Mm -hmm. We're planning to bring that to Ontario uh, very soon. So as well as, you know, the finishing options such as new paint colors uh, and textures, right? So textures within laminate is, uh, is going to become very popular and that's what we're looking to, uh, to expand our offering on. Um, innovation in functional design, so the way a window operates, opens, closes, and the features that are actually built into the window itself. Uh, you know, these are some of the exciting new things that we're working on. Um, they're going to be available through our distribution channel partners across Canada uh, in the very near future. You know, it's a it, it's an exciting new day. I mean, uh, 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 having 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 uh, having a triple offering. Uh, with 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 a full line and all the design options that you guys have laid out, I think is uh, is really going to help out uh, a, a lot of our a lot of our contractors, a lot of our builders, 
uh, when they're when they're looking at, uh, at different options and different things they want to do in the projects. Um, it's really going to help when when people are asking about energy efficiency. So uh, you know, congratulations to you guys on uh, on launching that northern uh, tripane line. It sounds uh, it sounds like something uh, uh, really exciting that people are are going to want to have take a look at. Um, uh, Paul, before be before we go, if uh, if people want to find out more, just tell us one more time where to go. Well, if they want to find out more about the Northern Tripane Collection, they can visit the brand new website that features our calculator. It's www.keepoutsideout.com or visit uh, gelvin.ca for more information about our door products. Here in Canada, we definitely want to keep the outside out. That's a that's a good uh, that's a good uh, moniker for the uh, for the website. Paul Camiso and Jeff Pigeon, thank you so much for joining me today. Fascinating conversation, uh, and uh, I think uh, I think everybody learned a lot. Thanks very much, guys. Thanks, Thanks for having me.